Okay, back on the Pioneer, I'm checking some resistors in the audio output stage. This 47k ohm resistor as well as this 470k ohm resistor both read out of tolerance. I'll demonstrate that now. Here's the 470k ohm resistor and we are reading around 660,000 ohms, so that's much too and the 47k resistor is reading 68,000 ohms which again is much too high okay I think I may have solved the problem I temporarily substituted this 1000 ohm cathode bypass resistor that you see here coming off of pin 8 of 6BM8 turn the volume down Now the only thing I hear is a little bit of power supply hum that I don't think we're going to be able to get that out. That's as good as it gets. Now let me tack in the offending resistor and we'll do a little comparison. Jimmy, we're rolling on the... Back, on, back with the offending resistor clipped in the circuit. <laughs> let, me do, let, me, let me do something here. Plug this in directly bypass the buzz of the isolation transformer. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but our hissing is definitely back. Okay, the hiss is gone. We have the good resistor in place. I think just to be on the safe side, I'm going to replace all of these gray dog bone looking resistors just to be on the safe side. <laughs> Okay, that resistor seemed to be the main culprit. Although I'm going to have to go to the parts house Monday and pick up some more resistors that I don't have in stock. There's also a few more out of tolerance resistors that need to be replaced, but once we do that, this thing ought to be good to go. Okay, I think we're about ready to wrap up the Pioneer SX34 tube type receiver. I replaced the, there was that one uh, 1K ohm resistor in the cathode bias circuit of the uh, triode section of one of the 6BM8 output tubes. It was causing a little bit of noise and I replaced every some more resistors that were out of tolerance and some of the noise I was seeing on the oscilloscope on the other channel was just I think me being too picky looking for too clean of a signal I think we got that as good as we can get it let's see here is the resistor that was causing the trouble let me get it up here on the magnifier yes this 1k ohm resistor right here goes from the preamp section of the 6BM8 cathode pin 8 to ground. And I also replaced this power switch. The, the owner of this unit had wired in a, a switch that he had on hand, but it was the incorrect type. And he made me promise not to make fun of his switch, so we won't make fun of it. Uh, the only thing I was able to find was a standard combination potentiometer and power switch. So I just have it installed here, and of course the potentiometer section is not used. And this capacitor is a 0 .01 microfarad cap wired across the switch. Its purpose is for noise and arc suppression. Are playing in the uh, the uh, you know, I didn't, I wasn't quick enough to recall the BQ. Wasn't my cake and eat it too. It wasn't the post K fame, maybe.
then I'm going to be confused. Okay. Is that if she is... Let's try AM. Now turn the fluorescent light off. done to his party or who who ends up lots of people that are, are looking for jobs and have to be yeah what about Jesus okay And we'll randomly select the winner every Thursday to deliver lunch to And here we are, all back together and ready to go back home to the owner. Only one ninety nine a month. Eleven and one. Author and we got the fire and we burn in one. This thing's got a pretty sensitive FM tuner in it. Mulligan's Restaurant and Lounge. Hotty and a bit mild with a shower and a couple spots. And here's the resistor that was causing the uh, noise. Here are all the old leaky paper and oil capacitors, as well as, as well as a few more resistors that were out of tolerance, as well as the old power supply diodes that I traced back to causing a little bit of noise. Here's some electrolytic capacitors out of the power supply that was borderline, so I went ahead and replaced them. Okay, here's another set of classic hits you'll only hear on 95.1. That's so cool. The buzz. Well, it would be even more cool if y'all had real DJs that played more than the same 30 songs over and over instead of your little uh, satellite feed, but... Okay, there you go, the Pioneer SX-34 receiver, ready to go back home until the next time. Okay, thanks for watching and more to come later.